part of our capital improvement program. The platform elevator at Grosvenor. All right, the great transit race of the newly expanded, now 97 station Washington Metro system is about to start. And there is station number one, Ashburn, new western terminus of the Silver Line. We have... few minutes until departure. Let's see if the screen comes back on here. Six minutes. Okay. So assuming that is accurate, we'll be leaving at 9.08 or 9.09. And then the stopwatch will start. This will be segment one of 14 that are planned, but who knows how many we'll actually end up with. It'll all depend on timing. Some of it will change as we go along. So, brand new Ashburn Station just opened at 1.54 p.m. yesterday. So this is the first morning that this station is in service along with the five others on the newly expanded Silver Line. And we are off. And the clock has started. Here we go. What could be probably eight hours at best case, 10 or 11 hours at worst case on the WMATA Transit Race, AKA DC Metro Challenge. Departing now from Ashburn Station, stop number one out of 97 I should actually say station 1 out of 97 because there will have to be about 35 repeat stops the way the metro system is designed let's see where's the map I have my own personal car as we get started if you're not familiar with Washington Metro here's the system map we are out here at the brand new Ashburn station We'll be traveling through Dulles Airport, and my first segment will go to East Falls Church. I will then take the Orange Line out to Vienna. Segment two, segment three, we'll go into downtown Washington to Metro Center. Part four will be the western branch of the Red Line all the way out to Shady Grove, and then a bus from Rockville over to Glenmont for the eastern branch of the Red Line, which will come down to Gallery Place, Chinatown. Then the Green Line out to Greenbelt, and then we start repeating, because we have to go all the way back on the Green Line to Gallery Place to then complete the Green Line down to Branch Avenue, and then go backward again to repeat to LaFont Plaza. And then from here, whichever train comes next, either blue, orange, or silver. Right now I have the plan going orange up to New Carrollton. Then there's a 19 minute bus connection over to downtown Largo. Pick up this end of the blue and silver line. And then lots of repeating going all the way through downtown Washington. Then finally again a new station at Arlington Cemetery. And then down connecting to the yellow line to Huntington for these two stations. Although the yellow line is actually closed until May 2023 for construction now. So this is, becomes an extension of the blue line. And then last but not least the blue line to end at Franconia Springfield. One of these two will likely be the end point, just depending on the train timing. So that is the plan. And we are now at Loudon Gateway. And that will be stop number, station number two. And I have a few 
companions coming on the train now. Other riders, not people that I know. I'm doing this solo. Who else would want to go spend an entire day riding the entire metro system? So I should note for the record, this train left at 9.08 a.m. So in case something goes awry with my stopwatch, that is the official starting time. So we are now approaching Washington Dulles International Airport Station. By far the most exciting new stop on the Silver Line and one that the airport has been waiting 60 years for since it opened in 1962. <laughs> So we're going along the cargo facilities here, and then we will bend to the passenger main terminal. And there's the terminal now in sight. Very exciting to be able to take the metro to and from Dulles Airport. Now I fly out of this airport all the time and have been counting down the years slash decades until I could take the train here. All right, so Dulles Airport, station three. Innovation Center, stop number four. Herndon, station number five. Reston Town Center, station number six. This is the last of the new six Silver Line stations that opened yesterday. So we'll now be heading toward Wheelie Reston E station which was the previous terminus of the Silver Line when the first section opened in 2014. So this is the last segment of the brand new Phase 2 of the Silver Line that opened yesterday. Wheelie Reston East, station number 7, and previous end of the Silver Line. Spring Hill, station number eight. Greensboro, station number nine. 
opening, step back to allow customer to exit. When boarding, please move to the center of the car. Tyson's Corner, station number 10. Doors opening, step back to allow customers to exit. When boarding, please move to the center of the car. Step back, doors closing. Lane, station 11, and the last unique stop on the original Silver Line and now the completed Silver Line. Step back, doors closing. Doors opening. Okay, East Falls Church. Station 12, and the end of the unique part of the Silver Line. This is the first multi-line stop on my journey. And, well, the first connection is going to be just perfect timing here, as there is an orange line to Vienna coming in one minute, which will start segment two. Got to go out to Vienna to the end of the western end of the Orange Line and then come back this way to head into Washington. These are the new destination signs. So that ends segment one. We are at 12 stations and 43 minutes thus far.